we're looking now at a nice lot of five different uh, mid-19th century uh, children's books uh, that relate to the teaching of science, natural history, uh, and natural philosophy to children. Uh, this one's 1839. It's illustrated, as we see, with little line drawings and a beautiful uh, period publisher's binding with a nice gilt spine, a seated child at the base there in uh, embossed boards with gilt lettering. This is also a very nice period binding, publishers leather backed with gilt rules, spine, and uh, pictorial paper covered boards. And it's uh, interesting because uh, of the date, 1839, and teaching of uh, natural philosophy to children. And by that, that is uh, things such as color, sound, uh, barometer, and uh, Look at the charming small little uh, line drawings. Like here's a balloon. Uh, it's all about mechanics. Look at this friction. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, charming. Look at this wagon with uh, wooden barrels and a ladder and scissors and a seesaw. And yeah, it's great. Uh, and here's another one. Uh, first lessons. Uh, it's. Um, by Mary Swift. It's a variant edition because this is the part first and this is the part second. So they're uh, two different books, uh, but they form uh, a pair. But this one here is the new edition, uh, enlarged and improved from uh, 1859, it appears. And again, we see the small, look at that, the uh, planets and uh, celestial diagram. Ah, yes, here we go. Original hand colored. Uh, plate here about colors and prisms and rainbows. It's very nice. It's very interesting. Same similar publishers, but in this case we have a cloth spine. This one was leather. Then we've got this. This is a very early publisher's plain cloth with a paper label, the original paper label on the front cover. Uh, this precedes this type of binding uh, before they started getting ornate like that. And these paper labels, this was a brief period. Um, it's quite a scarce item, this is. Nice early inscription. 1833, a book on the atmosphere. Great large woodcut of children playing. Um, some damp staining, as we see, but the book is quite scarce. Section on balloons and aviation. Looks like Icarus there, falling from the sky. And let's see. Yes, air station, reflection and refraction. Mountains, yeah, they're very interesting contents in a book like that. And the final book, of course, is this uh, Peter Parley in a beautiful period uh, gilt spine binding with a Asiatic turban man here and a erupting volcano and another person there. But on the front cover, we see embossed an American eagle with George Washington, and it's hard to say who that is, but uh, nice embossed patterns. And here we see this is all about animals. And the title page will tell us, oh, but Zoological Gardens in London. This is Boston, 1852. And there we are, vertebrae and mammals. And so this lot of five children's books is now currently available online from me, Brian DeMambro.